Hey, this is Corey, and in this screencast, I just wanted to quickly show some of the account management functionality in Pegasus. Uh, so this is this is a brand new Pegasus installation uh, using the wedding planning example uh, that I created last time. And the first thing I'm going to walk through is just the accounts creation workflow. Uh, so you can imagine that your user has has just showed up at your landing page, and you want them to uh, create an account. So they'll click on this button. Uh, this is obviously a very basic sign up form. Um, so I'm just going to enter my email and password. Um, and this can be customized. Uh, you can add fields here. You can add a, a second password confirmation if you want. Um, that's, that's all uh, documented. Um, and yeah, now I'm signed in. Uh, and uh, again, if you want to say require an email confirmation before you allow people to sign in, that's also uh, something that you can customize. Um, but uh, yeah, so this is uh, kind of the default functionality. And um, I just wanted to show some of the other features. Uh, so you can see this My Account section uh, has, has some tabs here. Um, the first thing you'll see is a profile page. Uh, so I can enter my details here um, and save that. Um, this image was automatically pulled in from, from Gravatar, so that's that's kind of like a nice little touch. You can provide a profile picture. Um, I can change my password. So uh, yeah, and you know, this has validation and, and things like that. Um, if you want to do that type of stuff, and obviously um, you can sign out. Um, so that's kind of the basic functionality. Um, obviously, sign in works the same. Uh, the other thing that comes out of the box is a password reset flow. Um, so I can click uh, forgot my password here, and I can enter my email and have it send that. Um, I've, I've just got the uh, console backend uh, email backend running, so it's not going to send an actual email. Um, but here's the email that would have gone out, which is just saying uh, someone has requested a password change, and I can click on that link, and that will give me uh, a new place here to uh, change my password. Uh, and if I could type, then Well, let me change it, and then I can go ahead and log in. So yeah, that's uh, that's basically it. Um, all of these pages are, of course, responsive. Um, so you know, uh, they have sort of mobile-friendly versions as well. Um, and yeah, so that's none of that you have to implement uh, yourself, and all of it will come right out of the box, uh, with working and and with lots of configuration options. Thanks.